What is going on guys? It is Super here bringing you another MKX video and today we're going to be talking about some possible hints about some state fatalities and also alien gameplay because NetherRealm Studio, you know, pretty much confirmed, which they did last week. You know, I already made a video talking about the combat cast that's going to happen this Thursday, but you know, just to remind you guys, if you missed that video, there is going to be an alien combat cast this Thursday, two days from now at... 2 p.m. Pacific time, 4 p.m. Central time, and 5 p.m. Eastern Standard time. So make sure you guys check it out. And if you guys don't, you know, uh, aren't able to catch it, make sure you guys tune into my channel on Thursday. I'm going to be covering the hell out of the combat cast. I'm going to be uploading all the gameplay, all the brutalities, fatalities, stage fatalities, which I'll be talking about in a bit. Um, but just if you guys missed a tweet by another realm, they pretty much confirmed it. It said, combat cast, no one can hear you scream. And we get a nice little screenshot of the alien looks really fucking sick uh but oh as you guys see in the bottom there i was the first reply to the tweet i saw it pop up and immediately tweeted yeah i am fucking excited for the alien combat cast it's gonna be so fucking hype haven't been this excited of course since triborg because triborg is come on three not three four robots so you know really really excited for the alien combat cast so moving on here uh there was a couple of questions as you guys see in the tweet it says ask any questions or any questions to be answered leave them here uh so a couple of people actually uh got their question answered by the nether realm twitter and i'll show them to you guys right now the first question was that got answered was uh the xenomorph's blood is acidic can it affect the gameplay and nether realm replied saying just wait and see um so i guess this is a little tease that the acidic blood is going to affect gameplay you know why would they answer it if it's not going to affect gameplay um what i was saying and what i've been predicting this whole time is the acidic variation is actually going to do damage over time if you get hits in with maybe the tail or maybe um you know the the acidic blood is like dripping because it does have a projectile we've seen that in the uh combat pack 2 trailer gameplay or a gameplay trailer i should say and uh you know the the you you do have a projectile in that variation so i'm assuming that acid is going to be leaking from like the tail or something like that so what i predicted before and you know since the start was maybe this is this variation is going to be something like venomous devora in which she has a uh, venom at the tip of her uh, stingers so every time she pokes you let's just say she gets four pokes on you with a specific um stinger that has venom uh, that does damage over time so that damage stacks up so maybe the fifth time that you poke the person with that poison it's gonna take a big chunk of damage so that is my prediction for at least the acidic variation or that's what i think is gonna be um you know game changing as far as the acid blood so if you guys have any ideas let me know in the comment section i know you guys always come up with uh you know some really good ideas but i think you know that's what's gonna happen with the acidic variation at least uh it's gonna do damage over time on specific moves that have maybe acid dripping from them so moving on here to the next question so this gentleman asks will there be more stage fatalities other than the pit and the tentacled cove what a way to put that right <laughs> uh what other skins will there be as you answered yes and netherrealm just replied saying find out tomorrow and i guess they mean two days from now because it's tuesday and the combat cast is on thursday unless they're gonna reveal something on wednesday which would be fucking amazing of course if any news pops up you know come into the channel i'm gonna cover all that um but does this mean that the tentacle um brutality fatality is confirmed for the cove now because if you guys remember if you guys didn't watch the video that i made on that leaked those leaked images of the cove state fatality pretty much what it is it's like a kraken monster that drags the opponent into the sea and rips them apart um and all you can see it's like it's long ass tentacles and the monster looks huge and it, it looks like it would be a really cool stage fatality and it looks like it would make a lot of sense being on the cove because if you guys remember whenever you do the stage brutality um the opponent goes into the sea and it takes like a second and a half for them to pop up and they're missing a head they're you know decapitated they're missing a couple limbs so obviously there's something down there that is 
ripping them apart you know what i mean so it, it would definitely make sense if this actually came true you know the screenshots looked legit even though the quality wasn't the best and um you know if you guys missed that uh, i'll put the reddit post in the description if you guys uh, didn't see the screenshots of that specific um you know leaked stage fatality but the point is we're going to be able to see if this is actually confirmation that this guy was telling the truth the whole time or if it was bullshit because they're going to be showing some stage fatalities in the combat cast so that's going to be it guys let me know if you are excited for the alien combat cast i know i am and i know a lot of you guys are as well so that's going to be it i hope you guys enjoyed the video and i will see you guys next time